honoring the life of 19-year-old Amara Marluk. I can't believe I'm talking about her in the past tense. With a growing impromptu memorial on the Portland State University campus. Amara was that person that you could just instantaneously connect to for sure. Flowers and candles at Southwest College Street and 6th Avenue. The place police say Marluk was gunned down, killed early Monday morning. I lose words because I, I cannot even express what, what I feel in terms of how can you do it? How can you? Bright Alozier, an assistant professor of black studies at PSU, was one of Marluk's teachers. She just did not practice what she believed in. She lived by it. He says as a student, she stood out passionate about being a voice for change. She was an ex executive at the Black Students Union and she really wanted to fight genuinely for racial equity, for more inclusion, for, for more diversity. You know, she was dedicated to the cause. Police charged Keenan Harpool with her murder. The 20-year-old freshman and former football player for the school appeared in court Tuesday pleading not guilty. Friends tell KGW the suspect had previously been in a relationship with Marluk. In the courtroom today, Marluk's family shared their pain. It's the mother, a mother's worst nightmare that somebody so evil that would take her life. I'm just so devastated. And they pleaded with the judge to keep Harpool behind bars. She was the light of our life, and we strongly, strongly encourage the court to protect other women who may face similar fates. For now, Harpole will stay in jail as those across campus and across Portland mourn the loss of a young life. Five years from now, who knew what or who Amara could have been? Who knew the kind of impact she would have made? In a video statement, PSU's president also expressed the university's deepest condolences and sympathies to Amara Marluk's family, saying she showed great promise in using arts to share her voice and her compassion for community. And our thoughts tonight with the wider PSU community and her extended family. Alma, thank you.